The framing effect bias is a cognitive bias in which people make different decisions based on how the options are presented or framed. Specifically, individuals are more likely to make a particular choice when presented with a positive frame or framing the options positively, compared to when presented with a negative frame or framing the options negatively. This bias is often seen in situations where the same information is presented in different ways, leading to different conclusions or actions. For example, when a medical treatment is presented as having a 90% success rate, people are more likely to choose it than when it is presented as having a 10% failure rate. The framing effect can also be seen in the media, where the way a story is framed can influence the way people perceive it. For example, if a news story is presented as, immigrants are flooding into the country, people may be more likely to view immigrants negatively, compared to if the same story was presented as, immigrants are seeking a better life in our country. One reason for the framing effect is that people tend to rely on mental shortcuts, or heuristics, when making decisions. In the case of framing, people may focus more on the way information is presented than on the actual content. Additionally, people may be more influenced by the emotions or feelings evoked by a particular frame than by the actual information presented. To avoid the framing effect bias, it is important to be aware of the way information is presented and to consider the content of the message, rather than just the way it is framed. It is also important to try to be objective and to consider multiple perspectives when making decisions. Here are two examples of the framing effect bias. Medical treatment. A medical treatment is presented in two different ways to two groups of patients. The first group is told that the treatment has a 90% success rate, while the second group is told that the treatment has a 10% failure rate. Even though both statements are technically true and convey the same information, the first group may be more likely to choose the treatment, while the second group may be more likely to reject it. Political campaign. During a political campaign, a candidate's stance on an issue is presented in two different ways to two groups of voters. The first group is told that the candidate is in favor of gun control, while the second group is told that the candidate is in favor of common sense measures to reduce gun violence. Even though both statements convey the same general idea, the first group may be more likely to oppose the candidate, while the second group may be more likely to support them. This is because the first statement frames the issue in a negative light, while the second statement frames it in a positive light. Thanks for watching.